I always record. Oh, okay. Have you got an ID with you? No, sir. You don't have one? I don't. I've lost mine. Oh, okay. Okay, I have I committed a crime. I'm sorry? Have I committed a crime? No, sir. I just need to know who you are. Like the same thing sir, what's your social security number? I'm not giving my social. What's going on, guys? Disorderly Product News. You know we got a good one when we have a trooper who looks like he's straight off the set of Full Metal Jacket. That's right. He came straight from boot camp to work in the highways and byways of Kentucky. It's a game of chicken. I'm asking you for your social security number. We're racing towards a cliff. Who's going to turn first? Oh, the anticipation. But anyways, first things first, before we get to the video, we got to do something. Cue the music! Disorderly disorderly product product I always record. Oh, okay. Have you got an ID with you? No, sir. You don't have one? I don't I've lost mine. Okay. Okay, I have a policy. Hold on one second. I'm just trying to find the thing. The reason I stopped is you're going 75 and a 55. Oh, and you didn't have your seatbelt on when you went by me. Yes, sir. I mean, I'll be Yeah, I, my thing. And I was also, following yeah, the GPS. I noticed your tag expired back in July. What? Yeah. Oh, God. Really? Yeah. Are you serious? Yeah. No, that I didn't know, sir. So I'm is this, sorry. This I was following the, back to you. Is this your car? Yes, sir. I, I was following the GPS. We're going to Hayden, Kentucky to get a free puppy for my daughter. Okay. And the GPS said it was 65, and I, so I know I would have still yeah, been speeding. Okay. I apologize. I, Watch all we're trying to slow people down. Yes, sir. I, I'm trying to find my... Have you I, got anything with your name on it, sir? Okay. Have I, I committed a crime? No, sir. I just need to know who you are. Hey, this is that's, my that's... insurance, and I sent in my payment of $91. I'm trying to find my policy number, though. Okay. Uh, hold on, this is, don't have my policy number. Hold on one second, huh? Hold on one second. Get, get in. Somebody's got to tell Tammy Talk a lot to put a lid on it. Before you know it, she's going to be telling on everybody. I need the glove box. I need the envelope. Hurry up. Please. I didn't want him to think we didn't have it. Here's her insurance. At the top, it has the, yes, sir. At the top, it says the policy number, and it shows the effective date that it's effective till December at the very top, December 17th. Okay. Um, so that's this a, is the policy on the car? Um, that, at the very top, there's a policy number. Yes, that's the policy number. The okay. very top. Policy number and effective date. Okay. Yes, sir. I'm sorry. It took me a minute to find it. So who does the car come back to? Both of us. Both of you? Yes, sir. Okay. Yes, it'll come back to Spain. Sir, mind. what's your social security number? Wait, did he just ask me for my social security number? Do you ever notice that cops do this? They'll take their pen out, they'll click it, they'll put it to the piece of paper as if it's a foregone conclusion that they're going to get the information that they already asked for. Anything else you want while you're taking down all my confidential information? Taking out the pen and putting it to the piece of paper must be like uh, the clerical form of stop resisting. As long as you're yelling it, you can do whatever you want. As long as you click that pen, you can ask for whatever you want. I'm not giving my social. Oh. You're not giving your information, so you're not going to tell me who you are. So I don't know. So you're John Doe right now. Because I'm trying to find out who you are. I mean, if you have any warrants on you or anything. It, well, in the state of ID. Kentucky, you only have the ID if you committed a crime being lawfully arrested. You need I'm an auditor, sir. I know my rights. Four, three. I'm sorry? I'm sorry. Did you want my... Don't give your social. No, I've got it. Oh, okay. If you give your social security number to a guy who's just like Ranger Rick on the side of the road, some stranger, then I'm sure you'll go out and buy a $500 gift card from Walmart to... A gentleman with an Indian accent. That's what I was giving Are you. Are you okay, sir? I'm fine. Okay, because I'm pulling her over for several violations on the vehicle, and you're telling her not to give me your information. So I'm just S social security ahead. numbers are private. I mean, you can get her name and okay, birthday. I'll, I'll give it. Let me stop that. Anybody know what she do? Oh no. Oh baby, it's it's dead. It's got a charge. Okay. You got Miami's driver's license. Sorry. And I am, I, I'm, I'm so sorry. I, I, well, that's fine. We're just out here trying to make sure everybody saw the down. Where's the yes, seatbelts, okay? Yes, sir. Thank yes, you sir. for having that baby in the car seat. Oh, God. Always. Yes. Always. 
Yes. Okay. At that age you, too. I'll give you a citation on the speed and seat belt. That's just a fine. Okay. But your tags, they did expire back in July, so you're going to have to get that taken care of through Tennessee. I will get that taken care of tomorrow. Are yes, you sir. living in Kentucky now, or are you still no, in Tennessee? No, we live in Tennessee. Okay, yes, you have to take care of it through Tennessee then. Yes, sir. What they need to do is they want to see them at the courthouse, okay? I okay. set a court date up all the way to October the 26th. Okay. If you can get it before then. I'm going to pay my fines online or call them in, correct? Well, yeah, but we have to go to court because of the registration. But I'm saying that they might let you fax that in. I don't know. Okay. okay. Oh, because we live so, so far away. So I'll give all the information for the courthouse in here, okay? Okay. Oh, because you live right. so far away, you mean? Right. Okay. So Thank try you. to be careful. Slow down yes, for sir. us, okay? Is this, this is the. Uh... Tammy, he's literally trying to get away from you in the car. Let him go. That's a man's job. The men always hold up better in these situations. I found uh, out. This is the whole citation, right? Yeah, that's the whole citation. Okay. That other one right there is the address and everything, okay? Oh, okay. Jeremiah, have a good day, brother. Thank you, sir. You have a good day. Wow. Did you catch that sneaky, tricky thing the trooper did uh, at the end there? I'll give you a second before I say it to think about it. But I made a video the other day about... Um, Sneaky things, uh, dirty tricks uh, officers will play. Like this officer when he said, uh, are you all right? Are you okay? Usually they'll take that farther. Do you have any mental issues? Uh, is there a problem? Because uh, you're not cooperating with When me. you say not cooperating, you mean I'm not bending over and acquiescing to every single command of yours? I don't know if you have uh, warrants. Yeah, that's right. You don't know. You just said the magical word. And you have the reasonable suspicion that I do. So you saying you don't know is the magic word is the magic phrase for you not getting anything. Oops, you're bad. There's a video that I just put up recently. You guys should go watch. Uh, it's If you go to my page and then you go to videos, it'll be like the third one down. Uh, I'll try and put it at the end here, but I count off each and every one of the dirty tricks cops use. Oh, is there something wrong with you? Do you have a mental disorder? Uh, take care there, Bob. You know, he wanted to let him know that he got his name, which wasn't that hard, seeing as the driver said the car's in both of our names. So as long as you can deduce a male's name from a female's name, uh, you're all good. You're on your way to detective out there in Kentucky, buddy. Keep it up. Unless they come out with a full metal jacket, too. Then you're going to be given a tough choice. Kentucky detective or extra in full metal jacket, too. Just like that uh, Kentucky State Trooper... Uh, did the little, aha, I got your name anyways, like it was a game. I did a video on other dirty tricks cops do. And uh, it's right here. So the complete video in its entirety will be in the description and linked in the comments. But watch. Called in, complaining that someone's checking door handles of cars. In this area? Yes, sir. That's unfortunate. Yeah. Do you live in this area, sir? Yes. Yeah, we're both good with What's the description of the person? Why are you being so difficult? I'm not being difficult, I'm asking. Dirty trick number one, why am I being so difficult? Because I'm not answering your questions as you present them, Curious George, I'm being difficult? You refused to identify when you first came up. So really, who's being difficult here? I'm asking questions. Okay, I just I just explained to you why I'm here. And I just said I'm not I just want to make sure checking that you're not. Are you okay? Are you yes. still okay? Are you? Do you have any mental illness that we need to deal with? Do you? No, I don't actually. Okay. Dirty trick number two. Is there anything wrong with you? Is it, are you all right, man? Are you stable? They usually do this one when they're personally offended, when their ego has been... I'm pretty sure, yeah, yeah. I guess you don't see the police car here either. Maybe you're struggling with that as well. Well, you just didn't identify... Dirty trick number three! Instead of IDing himself, he says, Well, look, I got a police uniform for him on. That's a police car. No, he wants to know who you are personally. You personally, he wants to know who you are. These things happen all the time. These are go-tos. He doesn't want to identify himself personally, so he pretends like it's just in general. I'm a police officer. Obviously, a police uniform, police car, police officer. Anyways, that's the thumbnail right there for the video. I told you it'll be in the description and it will be in uh, pinned in the comments section. But, like I said before, support this channel. Again, that will be in the description in the comment section. My name is Isori Product News, wishing you and yours a very safe and happy rest of the weekend. Good night.